up. We're gonna need it. Cause I think they're still biting. Hello, Hello fishing, fishing family, family and, and friends. friends. We hope everyone is doing fantastic. We are back with another fishing adventure at one of our favorite fishing spots. Um, we're currently working on catching bait just in case they don't like our artificial. Because we want to do speed crawl versus Helgramite today. The Helgramite did great here last time. Well, the time before last. And we gonna see about that today, but we do have live bait just in case. Oh, whew, that scared me. It was a pretty butterfly on me. I should have come back, butterfly. I think he liked my shirt. He was blue. That was a very pretty butterfly. Um, yeah, we wanted to go all the way to the mouth. We always want to go to the mouth, but we think we heard someone on their way. They're gonna beat us because they have a car and a boat. So, <laughs> regardless, we know some really good holes down this way. Well, anyways, we're hoping to catch some big fish today. All right, still heading downstream, but I decided to hit the GoPro on the difficult stretch. I really should have had it rolling when I ran into that tree. Well, actually it was a rock, but the tree was like so low that I was like under the tree. I went through all kinds of trees, all kinds of limbs, all kinds of leaves. Now I need to focus on this area though. This is on to the next obstacle. Right down the middle. Yeah, that's what we usually do. We usually roll right over the fridge. We think it's a fridge. We call this the fridge. There's a tree down there, though, on the other, on the very end of the tree that might be a problem. Yeah, we usually crash into the trees at the end. All right, here goes the fridge stretch. Oh, it used to be worse than this before. A lot of it got cleared out. There's the fridge. We can roll over the fridge today. <laughs> oh, here it is. Oh, f not bad today. Piece of we didn't do bad today. We're getting, I don't know, but we're getting better. Oh. All right, we've made it to the mouth. It's here we're gonna throw the live minnows, right where the creek meets the duck. The river looks pretty muddy. Throw right into the mud line. There might be some good smallmouth in there. It's always a good time to fish this area when the river is up. So we're looking forward to this. This is a stiff one. Apparently I got the wrong pole rigged. Oops, that's a bad cast. Not where I meant to throw it. That's not a geode, is it? What is that rock? No, but if you think it's cool, I'll take it. Oh no, I'm just looking at it. <laughs> Ugh, I gotta re-throw. That's not where I wanted to throw. Plus, there's definitely a snag right there. I remember. Oh, I got a fish, though. Uh -huh. And my drag's loose. My drag is really loose. <laughs> that may be a big fish. Walk down that way with you. No, he's oh, gone. Well, I was gonna say, he, he broke the hook. Broke it, huh? I can feel that the hook is gone. Yep. Holy crap, what was that? All right, let's do this thing. Oh, not right far there. enough. Right there, on the money. I'm ready for you this time, fish. Oh boy, that was my ass. That's fun, wasn't it? There must be several of them out there. Cool, well we're going to catch several of them then. Yeah. 
Oh, he's five and a half pounds. My camera keeps cutting itself off for some bizarre reason. So I'm thinking, let me make sure I got a picture. All right, say goodbye to Rocco. Oh, Rocco is just bit me as soon as I put him in the water. Ow. Bye, Rocco. Thanks for the fight. Yeah, he's running, isn't I'm he? walking him down. He don't got nothing to run with now. There we go. Oh, there is a tree right there. Oh! Don't go by that tree! This is fun. Walking them down. How am I supposed to do that? Like, I don't think I can... He gonna have me wading to the chest. All right, I'm officially in the Duck River. <laughs> I'm officially, he got me in the river. He's got, I haven't even seen him. Oh, he's fighting hard. Oh, yeah. Like he's not even tired yet. He said, I've got three more hours in me. There he is, I saw him. I saw him too, it's another one of them. It's another striped bass. Or this one might be a white bass or a hybrid. He looks a bit more round. That looks like a hybrid. That's just a small one. Oh, is it? He's fat. It must be a mama fish. Oh, it is a small one. Little booger. Small one's got my small one's got my arm sore. Oh! All right. This one's half the size and my arm hurts. <laughs> this is more like what I'm used to seeing here. Ow! This one's, you're free. This one's half the size. Whoa. You're a drink. Take the pull. <laughs> half the size. So he, he wasn't half the fight though. No, that's a good fight. Gotta hold on to him tight. Another one <laughs> came to the mouth looking for big small mouth, but there seems. Glad seemed... you convinced me to come down here. I know. I had to convince smallmouth slayer to come down here because he's caught a really nice smallmouth here. That's what I thought was going to happen, but there seems to be like a whole school of striped bass out there. So we're going to catch all of them before we leave. Golly, when they get it, they grab it and go, don't they? They do. Give me some line. Yeah. Yeah. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Walking them down again. <laughs> here we go. Here we go again. Let's get a shot of a happy fisherman here. A happy master angler. <laughs> a happy master. You're still a happy master. These are angler. small stripes. The funny part is, if you don't know fish and fishing, the stripes we're catching today are actually considered small. I mean, that one was the biggest one I've ever caught. But considerably small because they're big fish by nature. Watch that tree right there. Oh, he got me into the duck again. <laughs> oh, there's a whole smuck of them out there. Oh, yeah, that's another one. That's oh, another one. Oh, that's a good one again. Bring him around that tree and we'll get him. Small mouse, I got his feet. Going in. Small mouse, go get him. Going in. Get him. Going in. Going in. Come here, fish. He got you. Come here, fish. He got you waiting in the meat. Come back, get Wait, see? 
Woo. He got away from me for the moment. We're going to have you drag it out. Out there. Oh, there we go. Oh man. <laughs> <laughs> Woo. Another, Another one. Good one. Holy good crap. One. Another good one, good one, good one. We didn't even get the minnow. Ha ha. ha. He's good. like, don't drop my fish. <laughs> no, Alright, we have to take him up here. Get that fish. Okay, let's go. Ooh. Follow me, small mouse layer. <laughs> This is a lot of fun. They are, they fight like yeah. man. I wonder if <laughs> Today would have been a great day to bring our bring cat fishing poles. Alright, this one. Oh, this one's an inch smaller than that first one. Yeah. Okay, let me get underwater release again. Oh, Pulling like that. That's a fish. Oh, yeah, here we go. Here we go. Walking them down to this log. You ready to say hi to the camera? You ready to say hi to the camera, buddy? I'm going to make sure I'm going out as far as I can. Walking down to the camera. Oh, he said, I'm going to go the other way. I don't want to walk to the camera. Oh, walk this way. <laughs> Swim this way. <laughs> walk this way. Isn't that a song by somebody? Aerosmith. <laughs> walk this way. Well, it looks like you don't get the camera. That's a smaller one this time. Yeah. I'll walk him on down there. You can get him on the camera. That'd be, watch that log right there, though. I'm hoping I got some cool underwater footage. I don't know. I'm experimenting today. All right. We don't have to measure or weigh him because he's definitely smaller than the first, what, three? This is striker number four. I'm so excited. Get her done. Didn't start quite at that point, but they seem to be biting regardless. Something's already got it. Already. Golly. Already. Walk them down. Oh. Oh, I should have, I got to retie after this. This feels like a bigger one. I tightened the drag a little bit on this one. Oh, it's because it's out in the freaking river. This is what happens when a big fish takes a little woman. <laughs> the fish is trying to drag her in. It is like it's, it almost feels like a freaking snag. She's digging her toes in. She's digging her Actually, toes what ends up happening is that the, the rod tip ends up into my stomach. She, she thinks she has the fish, but the fish thinks it has her. Big fish, little woman, but the battle is on. Oh, the battle is on. This one yeah. is relentless. I feel it. Big fish, little woman battle. Here we go. I feel it in its spirit. It doesn't want to be caught. <laughs> uh. <laughs> well, it's going this way. Going back up. That's you. Stay away from those trees. No, fighting a fish upstream is not fun. You ever tried the net of fish against the current? Oh, you probably have today. So let me take you out here where we're hanging out. Yeah, get you out here in my 
Uh, I know, I'm gonna get attacked. There's probably like 20 of them out yeah, here. Get out here with my friends. How many of these usually hang out in school? I don't know. Just it depends on how many there are living here. All of them, it looks like. <laughs> oh, yeah, right there. Nice. Right about the average size. Yep. He fought, he fought like a bigger one though. Uh, oh yeah, this might be a male then. <laughs> Another one, holy crap. Another 24 incher going back in the water. Woo that one wanted to go. Fish is coming back for it. came back. Oh yeah, fish on again. Oh, she's fighting that drag. Yeah, these fish just don't. They have no mercy on your life. They will drag you out into that big river. Big fish, little woman. Here we go again. Oh, uh oh. Mm. Got oh, me one. Got me one. Okay, so who's fishing net and first? Who's ever comes up first, I guess. Where's the net? Did you bring it? I got it under my arm. Okay. Oh my gosh. Got it under my arm. Here we go, here we go. Big fish, little woman. Again, take two. It's trying to drag her out there. She thinks she's got it, but it thinks it's got her. It's, uh, uh, all right, here we go. Here we go, here we go. Wow, <laughs> we were fighting two fish at once and I netted them while my fish was in the net. Wow, wow, do these fish hit top water? Yeah, I don't know if these out here would, but they do, they especially be... at night. Really? Yeah. I got oh, a chopo in the bag. Here's that fish if you want to hold on to that one, maybe give it a drink, I don't know. I don't know. Well, look at the line. Oh, we'll know if we'll know here in just a minute. I'll see which one is still Fish! Let me give him a dip. All right. Oh, they, yeah, they like to bite for me. Bye! We could have just swim it off in the same direction. They're so cute. Look at them. They're swimming off. <laughs> They're talking amongst each other right now. <laughs> Which one of them caught you? I'm not sure. <laughs> Did the girl I, hope the, I hope the pretty girl caught me. So this is either, if I catch another one, it's either going to be six or seven. Oh, ouch, oh. Something bit me. Some big bug. Ow. Oh, I got fish biting. Oh, fish biting and bugs biting at the same time. Fish on! Fish on! <laughs> yeah, I'm giving my battery a rest because we still got plenty of river to cover. But I got GoPro on my chest. <laughs> I'll camp out here. Hey, we got food. Okay. We just got to start a fire. <laughs> I'm sure there's a lure that they'll bite. I almost want to try an artificial. You want to experiment? You want to see if they'll hit something else? Nope. Nope. Not one All right. Gosh, I'm so glad it's us here today, not someone else. Because, I mean, anyone could have been fishing down this river today and stopped here and fished. They would have anchored real quick. <laughs> I know I would. The good thing is you can only keep two of these a day, I think, though, for so many weeks. Like, I was 18 inches or 17. You only, I think you only keep two of So somebody wouldn't fish them out. Oh. As long as they abide from the wall. Well. 
I mean, they got so much meat on them. What? I don't need that many. Got me out here in the duck. I might get ate by a river monster. Man, I have one muscle bigger than the other. <laughs> Reeling these fish in. Oh, What's this? Thinking this is number That's number seven, maybe. Seven. I think it's seven. Please. Number seven. All right. How much was the length? Twenty. A little bit over twenty-three. The average size is twenty-three and a half, twenty-four inches, which is uh, mm. pretty small for a striper, but. The type of fish we catch, this is big. <laughs> oh, I see your new body glove in there. I need one of them. I got jets. That's, that's, five, that's over five pounds. Five point one. Five pounds. Nice. Five point, so most of them are running five pounds. There he is. A, wow. Nothing like catching five pound fish. Five and a half. Let's get you out of here, big girl. Get you out of here. <laughs> got a lot of loose slack on this one. What kind of line you got on here? Huh? I think it's halfway on the tip up there. It likes to pull up. That crate bait puts some pulls in it. Maybe some of I got a fish too, so. Maybe we can check that out. Got a tight drag. There we go. Striper number eight. Cause we already know that's what's at the end of this rod or the end of this line. Wow, it makes me wonder what other fish we got today. Okay, yeah, don't make fun of me because I adjust my drag like nine times. Is he walking me into the deep big river. Oh, he came up. I hope my GoPro captured that. It's kind of hard to tell when they're walking me downstream. Oh, don't walk me into this deep water. I mean, swim me into the deep water. I act like fish can walk or something. Oh, I about tripped on this log. Yeah, there you can turn up right there. You can walk up there on that part. What you got him over that log. Once you get around that log, you can go up there. You think it's getting a little deep? Yeah, you can <laughs> use it that way. Where are you, big fish? We know you're out there somewhere on the end of that line, trying to drag Ashlyn under the water. It sure is. It's funny how they. Stop for a second, then it's just like. I wonder what the trophy measurement is on Ashley. For the rock fish part. <laughs> five foot five. <laughs> five foot five. Is that the trophy measurement? Yep. Oh man, giving you, you know, taking a picture of you, measuring you, weighing you. You'll be on his wall. to get a little. Certificate. When we let him go, he's gonna go back and tell the whole squad that he almost had me. He gives it a little certificate from the state. Rockfish number eight is fighting hard. He might be my one of my bigger ones oh, today. Oh, there he is. No, he's not hung. He's just fighting, isn't he? <laughs> These fish will have you thinking they're hung until they... Zzz, zzz, zzz. See, it's fine for a minute, then it's going to... Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Where are you, fish? He's trying to fight to the death. Oh, he's, he's, he's determined to drag you in. He's determined. He's not going to... That might be the biggest one yet. He got in the muddy water. Come here, fish. Nope, going out there again, aren't you? You're not quite ready yet. Walk back up that way. Go back there. You go. Come here, fish. Hey, turn this way. Don't turn that way. You're supposed to turn this way. Come on, come on. Zoom. Oh, good job, small mouth slayer. He's uh, 24 and a half again. I don't know. That's a good one. Let's go, let's go get his measurement. That is my biggest one, maybe. 
Smallmouth fishing turned into striper fishing real quick. Well, we didn't really have a target fish in mind, but smallmouth are always in mind. Okay, the scale or the fish stick is ready. Oh, this might be one of my bigger ones. This might be the biggest one, weight wise. That's a good one. Wow. That's a hunk. I think it's going to be the longest one, too. That's a hunk. Oh, look at him. 25, 25. and a half. <laughs> yes. Okay. Definitely going to get a picture here. All right. I've got my biggest personal best here. 25 and a half inches. We're about to get his weight. Really goes to the power. Biggest one. Biggest one thus far. That was a heck of a fight he gave me, too. Oh, my that was, gosh. That was the longest fight of the day. <laughs> he about walked us down halfway to the, the mouth of this river. No, I'm kidding. Golly, six. Six. 6.6. Six. Wow. 6.63. Was that six and a half? Six, no, it's over six and a half. That's all, this is almost a seven pound fish. Six and five eight. Six and five eight. Oh my gosh. Definitely. Golly. Wow. You definitely still shot with him. Yeah, I want a picture of your hand too. This is awesome. This is awesome. Oh, wow. <laughs> Right on, small mouse player. Yes. Eight stripers in. I'm going to see if I can get an artificial fish. How many pounds you got on here? With the, uh, that had the, uh, okay, I'm gonna swap the Helgramite out for a, 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 yeah, something like that. No, oh, that's fairly, that's about the size of some of these minnows. I might be able to get them with this. Think that's too small for them? Anyways, I'm gonna use this. Oh man, fish, fish, hey, fish on the artificial. All right, I go back up. Oh, oh mine jumped. That's a pig. If you start, well, I go back up and get some nips. Golly, you're the good one. On the swim bait or the fluke zoom fluke, pearl sparkle, something like that. A Texas rigged them. Took more, it took more casts than it was taken with the minnows, but I knew they'd hit it because it looks just like the minnows were throwing at them. God, oh, look at my weight up there. Striper number nine. I fooled this one with a fake minnow. And he's pulling me into the big river. Oh, by the way, by the way, smallmouth slayer has a fish too. I'll be all right. What is that? It's a striper. Is it? Yeah. Hey, he ready. All right, oh. now go ahead and take yours and I'll keep fighting mine. Two fish, one net time. I know, we're not gonna put both of them in there. Yeah, why not? You got him. Ooh, what about your fish? I'll get him. Go ahead and take yours. I want to scoop yours with. Ow, he's spiking yeah, he's me. Spike me too. <sighs> okay, I'm gonna hook him and release him real quick so I can get small ice layers fish. He looks no bigger than the rest of them. Okay. Well, I gotta get a measurement on him. You think yours will fit into the small net? All right, all right. I got one of these big stripers to eat this zoom fluke. Let's see what I can cast, but I got him. 
Meanwhile, small one slayers down there and has a fish. That he's got the fish, but I don't know. Oh, he's trying to get away. Dang, he wiggled the hook out for me. Wow, it's another massive one. Number nine, fooled on the artificial. Got him at 24 inches. Oh, you got a nice one too. Still shot. Oh man. Let me still shot with me, hold mine like Oh, they, <laughs> they don't stop. <laughs> oh, here we go. All right, very good. Okay, let's, let's get you out of here. Goodbye, buddy. He came off the, uh, oh, look at him, he's hanging out. He came off the fluke in the net. <laughs> oh, he did? Yeah. Number 10. Okay, let's see. Yeah, oh yeah. Oh, oh you were fighting. As soon as you hit the water. Yeah, I, we, I got him netted a little quicker. Storm's here. The storm is here! We're about to get stormed on. I can tell the way the wind's blowing. The storm is here. It seems like it's blowing fairly quick, so I think it's, it'll blow past us. I don't know. Storm is here! Everything's waterproof but me. <laughs> storm is here. About to fish in the storm. Lynn, in this one in the storm, I literally just got done saying you don't want to be in the water when there's lightning. But here we are in the water when it's lightning. We haven't saw lightning yet, but I'm sure it's almost here. Where? I haven't seen him one time. The water's the water's dirty. Nice. This one's got more of a golden look to him. First, oh, fish on! This is a good thing I got snacks because now I got a fish. Loosen up your drag a little bit. Make my fight a little harder. This is striper number 11. Number 11. Catching more striper today in the same spot than people probably catch their whole life. Ooh, this one's trying to drag me into the duck. Well, haven't they all been trying to drag me into the river? <laughs> oh, I almost tripped on that stump. Is it me or did that one get covered more? Did the water, the water got deeper. See? No. Yeah, it did. Not really. I don't know. That stump just. Used to. About the same size as all oh, the I other see, ones. Yep. I saw him. A glimpse of him. Oh, a big glimpse of him. Man, he got a glimpse of me too. <laughs> This one's taking the sound far. This is about where they usually... Oh, one of the smaller ones of the day. Oh, you missed me. There you are. There we go. Yeah, he's kind of, he's still long, but he's thinner. One of the smaller ones of the day. Look right in the side of the mouth, that's good. Look at him. He's missing part of his fin. Yep. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We know we haven't caught him today. Ah, oh, he bit me. He, He's doing good to Ashlyn. He bit me. Oh. He thinks he caught you. Those bottom fins hurt. He says, I caught you. <laughs> oh, there he is. About to let him go. No, definitely one of the smaller ones of the day. Bye, buddy. Wow, there's a ton of those. 11 striped bass in. How many have you caught? Uh, <laughs> wow, that's 18.
team striped bass. All right, we are to what I refer to as the good hole, hoping to catch some good fish. Got a, got a fish. Got a fish. Thought it was a snag for a second, but this is most definitely a fish. Smally! Got a smally, everyone. And he looks like he's at least 16 and a half, 17 inches. Could be misleading you, but he's definitely a good sized fish. Yeah, this is a decent smally. Get up here, smally. Landing net so far away. Not done fighting. Not done fighting yet. Oh. Mm -hmm. ah. He gave up. He gave up. Whew. I don't know where Smallmouth Slayer is, but he's missing me. Miss <laughs> Smallmouth Slayer's missing the Smallmouth Sling. All right, not a bad Smallie. He like he choked the Helgramite. I'm talking. He choked it. Yeah, about 16 and a half inches right there. No. Oh my gosh, I just, I had a difficult time with that fish. <laughs> Here he is though, I'm about to release him. I hope he's all right. He choked that hook. And now I have to retie because my hook is gone. But I think he's all right, he's swimming off. Swim off a little slow, but he swam off. Fish, big, small, I like them. Oh, fish, fish. Oh, he let it go. What was it? I don't know. Whatever it is, it's back. It's back. What are you? A little smally. Yeah. World smallest. World smallest largemouth. Actually, it's a largey. A largey, first one of the day. A little largey. Dark. Female largey. Hey, what's up, fishing family and friends? Thank you so much for checking out that vlog. I have looked forward to getting that edited and posted for so long now. I am so behind. And that is one video that I have just been like itching and scratching to get to. And I finally got it done. I'm so excited. We were not expecting to catch all those striper that day. That was a, we're going to go to the mouth because the river's up and catch big small mouth day. But that was not the type of day we had at all. Uh, but I'm going to try to make this quick because this was a longer video. And I'm trying to work on some more videos. But I'm going to be trying to get this stuff out trying to do some different stuff because i know it's i like fishing so i can go fish and do the same type of fishing in a lot of the same spots like every weekend and it would not bother me but i'm trying to change it up just so i can get a feel for a new adventure because i love exploring new places and also so i can show you guys some new stuff as well so i've got a lot of exciting stuff i've done the past few months and a lot of stuff I look forward to doing uh, next spring, uh, summer and fall. I know we still got some fall to winter transition fishing left and I absolutely love fishing in the winter too. So I look forward to that. And also I am interested in doing tournaments. I uh, don't really have as much time because of work and the kids, but um, it is on my bucket list. Like it's something that people ask me all the time when I tell them how much I love fishing. You know, they ask me if I get into tournaments and it's not something that I have gotten into, but I really want to do some type of kayak fishing tournaments and even just like bass fishing tournaments on boats and stuff. Just, just stuff that I really want to get to doing um, because I just, I just love fishing. Y'all know that. And I'm sure if you watch these videos, 
you love fishing too. So just stay tuned. Thank you, everybody. Remember to go to the description of this video to find my fish brain information. If you are not subscribed to my fish brain, go ahead and do that. That will allow you to see my catches before I even post the vlog for them. So you'll see my best catches first on there. I don't post all my catches on fish brain, but I post my best catches. And you can send me messages on there for um, like suggestions on places to fish or things to throw or things that I can try to help me um, this fall and winter while I fish. So thank you guys so much.